the Toy Reviewer! Hi, Brittany the Toy Reviewer here, and today we're going to be taking a look at the Crayola Washable Neon Sidewalk Paint. And in the set, it includes nine pieces, and it is a great big bright outdoor art set. So, if we take a look at the back, it shows that this entire box is actually the tray, and it's a reusable paint tray. So we get three colors, red, yellow, and blue, and those are our primary colors, so we get to make all colors from those. It says that it is eye-popping, and it is great for gigantic games and huge drawings and artwork. And we get to mix our paint and create different colors, so let's go ahead and open it up. Alright, so let's take a look at the things we got in this set. We got our blue paint. We have some yellow paint. And we have some pink paint, which is kind of weird because on the box it definitely showed red, but this is more pink and the yellow actually kind of looks green. Alright, if we turn it around, we have our giant paintbrush. We have three colors of chalk, orange, yellow, and white. And we also have this little rolling sponge. And of course, the entire kit comes in the tray. So right here, we have three slots that will fit our paint bottles. Here's our slot for our paintbrush. So since we aren't outside, what I'm going to be using is a giant chalkboard. Alright, so each of these has a little seal right here, so we're going to need to rip this off. Alright, so I've just taken the seal off and now what I'm going to do is shake it. It says to shake it well, but it doesn't really feel like it's moving around in there very much. So I'm just going to go ahead and, I guess, take the top off a little bit and shake it some more. I think we got it. And now let's go ahead and pour in our paint. That's good. Let's start by trying out our chalk. Alright, so here is what our regular little sticks of chalk looks like. Now let's get a little bit of blue with our brush. And let's draw um, maybe like a little square. Let's see how that looks. Hmm, it's not really showing up. We might have to kind of stick it on there. Now let's try a little bit of yellow. And now let's do some pink. Alright. So now I'm going to mix some colors. I'm going to try mix and make some purple. So I have some pink, I'm going to try and mix it with some of this blue. And that mixed really well. Now we got a nice purple color. I'm just going to do some purple right here. Alright, so now I'm going to do some blue and I'm actually going to mix it in with this yellow and try to make some green. 
here is our green. And here, let's try our green. Let's pour some more blue. And use our roller. Let's go ahead and roll it across. And some of this green color. And some pink. All right, with this set, we were able to make three different textures. We have our regular, like, writing chalk texture. We have this one here with the paintbrush. And my favorite, which was the roller. So this set was really interesting. I thought it was really cool, these different textures that we were able to make. But I've been touching the, like, the chalk that I did with the paintbrush, and it's still very, very wet. And also, this one over here, even though you would think it would dry faster because it's just a light sponging, is still very wet as well. So, of course, if you're out in the summer heat and you're playing on the sidewalk, it'll probably dry a lot faster. Also, if you're out, you know, on the sidewalk, it'll probably look a little bit different um, depending on if you're, like, on the sidewalk or on pavement but this is what it looks like on a very smooth surface so you can really see how things look and of course it was a lot of fun we have this reusable tray over here and the tray is really cool that it comes with and of course if you like this video don't forget to like subscribe comment and stay tuned for more videos all right so as you can see as it is drying we get a much lighter color and it just feels more like chalk here is the pink and here is its color after it dries and of course the green over here it also shows up a lot better on this black once it's dry and here is the edges of the sponge effect as it's starting to dry Don't forget to check out our other fun videos, and as always, thanks for watching!